Hello! This short video is not part of our linguistic e-lecture series that you find in this channel. Rather, it is a video with which we want to take part in a competition for financial support to create a trilogy of free online courses for teachers of English as a foreign language. And this is the background of our project. As you know, there are billions of learners of English as a foreign language and the way they speak is influenced by the structure of their mother tongue and this can have severe effects. I will illustrate this on the basis of two well-known speakers. A German speaker with a strong German accent speaking English and a speaker from France who uses English with a strong French accent. Let us look at them and let's start with the Frenchman. Here we are. Do you have a license? Monsieur? City Ordinance 47B prohibits the playing of any musical instrument in a public place for the purpose of commercial enterprise without a license. I don't understand. Well, and here is a German who speaks English with a strong German accent. We are putting in place a broad range of measures that member states can use to improve the efficiency of their energy use. We could show many more examples of this kind. Chinese speakers of English who have a strong Chinese accent, Spanish speakers who have trouble with a number of phonemes and so on. So the goal of this online class is clear. We want to familiarize future teachers of English from all over the world with the central principles of teaching English in the context of their native language. And we want to serve on the job EFL teachers with up-to-date principles of teaching English as a foreign language. Thus, our MOOC is contrastive. It compares English with the target language and outlines the main problem zones for the native language learner. Since it is impossible to include the linguistic principles of all 7,000 human languages, we will focus on six of the most important ones where the flags that are put on this map only represent the heartlands of the language. Think about the Spanish speakers in South America and you will understand how many speakers and learners will be affected by our MOOC. For the creation of the MOOC this means that we have to record contrastive data for these languages as integral parts of our videos. For some languages such as German, Spanish and Arabic we already have contrastive data in our open language index that we created in the context of the Clarendy research infrastructure. Here is an example how we integrate such data into a video. The two high vowels E as in C, C and U as in two. Two, they're often produced too high and Germans tend to produce the monophongal variants instead of the slight diphthongal realization in RP. The other languages will be added if our MOOC proposal is approved. This will be done together with our international master students who will not only serve as native speakers but will also simulate English speakers with a strong accent of their native language. Our MOOC will consist of 13 units. Each unit is based on one or two didactically carefully designed e-lectures which will be recorded in front of this active board whose content that will be generated during the production of the video will also be made available in print. This enables our students to follow our e-lectures using the board content at the same time. Additionally, we will use several flanking measures that guarantee high quality and efficient learning materials. These are additional micro-teaching videos where particular phenomena will be explained via short screencasts and additional practical questions and model solutions in the HTML format as well as additional quizzes and test questions that can be used in a variety of testing tools. Well, that's it. 
We are sure that our experience of more than 10 years of online teaching and the high quality of our e-lectures and the additional material will result in what you all need. A MOOC on EFL tailored for speakers of several major languages in the world. I'm sure you will all like such a massive open online course. Thank you.